right, so I'm pretty excited about my next project. Uh, some of you know, I just had a son. He's about a week and a half old right now. We named him Cooper after my favorite car, a 1930s Model A Coupe. So as you see, I named it Cooper's Coupe. Well, this is gonna be the next project. It's going to be a uh, hot rod stroller. So the um, plan is to build my own frame for it. I'm gonna cut a hole out of the top here, cut the windows out. I'm gonna take off the fake frame that they have going on here and plan is to make it low, you know, like a hot rod, like a rat rod, basically low to the ground. And I'll have like a big, uh, you know, bar coming out the back where it'll have a handlebars basically where if you turn it, it'll steer the front wheels. It'll have a steering linkage that goes all the way through to the front. Um, and actually whenever you steer with the steering, uh, with the handlebars, it'll actually steer the front wheels. Um, I'm going to cut out the hood area, build a firewall, um, and then build some kind of like engine, exposed engine. So that's the plan. And uh, so stick around. Let's see how it turns out.
So this is the right height I'm looking for. This will give you an idea how it's gonna sit. These are the wheels and tires I'm gonna use. I'm gonna paint the back wheels black to match the front. But this is about the height that it's gonna sit at. So one thing I'm pretty excited about on this project is I'm gonna go with an air ride suspension. I found these little airbags that are used for uh, seats on an 18 wheeler. But it's the perfect size to be used uh, for the front spring. And I'm gonna use one for the back spring as well. And so I'll have, hopefully I'll be able to fit an air tank here <clears throat> with maybe a compressor sitting on top of it to make it look kind of like a blower. And uh, you know, that'll be like the engine basically. And I'll put some exhaust pipes coming out the side of the, of the air tank um, to make it look like an engine, make it look pretty cool. And um, it'll have a functioning air ride system. So I've got all the fittings. both airbags, all the air fittings I need. Uh, both valves. So, you should be good to go. Well guys, that's it for this video. I'm sure I'm a little more excited about this project than you guys are, but if you did like it, hit that like button. Let me know what you think about it in the comments. If you're new to the channel or if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. And if you can think of anything cool I should do to it, let me know. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about the golf cart and it's not taking a back seat to this project. I'm just gonna be kind of splitting time between the two. And obviously this one, you know, it's not gonna take a whole lot of time. Uh, it's a lot smaller of a project, so don't worry. It's not gonna get in the way of this project. Um, I'm still gonna spend the majority of my time working on the golf cart. In the next video of the coupe, I'm going to be working on the suspension, so uh, keep an eye out for that. And in the next golf cart video, I'll be working on the front axle to get that front differential flipped and get the measurements taken to get the drive shaft in the shop, get that built. So pretty soon it'll be four wheel drive and then I'll get to work on building a roll cage for it. Well that's it for this video guys, I'll see you guys in the next one.